Oh, dude. I think Dave, he got another rod over here going off. It's a big one. He's in like a school of drum or something. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm out here at Navarre Beach. I'm gonna meet up with a couple people today to do some fishing. David Scott's out here from Indiana. He comes down like three or four times a year to do some surf fishing. And he's, t he's always tearing the fish up. So I'm sure he'll get on them today. And uh, Dave makes some honey. It's called Scott's Honey. It's some of the best honey I've ever had. And I'm gonna leave a link in the description for his Facebook page. So you, if you're interested, contact him, get some of that honey. Man, it's good to cook with, put in your tea, really anything. Just eat it, I'll squirt it right out of the bottle. And then Cheyenne Rebecca, she's got a Facebook group called The Southern Yankee, and she's always cooking up awesome fish dishes that just look so delicious. So be sure to check out her Facebook group. I'll leave a link in the description for that as well. Anyways, I'm gonna get set up and let's get on some fish. A little bumpy bump on this one. Nothing big, but it's enough to make me run. Sometimes those pomp don't hit very hard. But uh, where this one's at, I'm thinking catfish, just from just because it's so far out there. I don't know, he's got some head shakes. Yeah, he's feisty. We'll see. Hopefully it's a pomp, that'd be awesome. Whatever it is, it's running in fast. Oh yeah, he's a pop. I see him. He's a good size one too. There he is. Pompa no. Caught him on a green shrimp fish bites with a pink and white float. He looks a lot bigger out in the water. I'm gonna measure him. He's a keeper for sure. He's probably about 12. Yep. First pump of the day. Let's see if we can get some more. This rod over here going off. I catch more fish when I'm further away from my rods. That's that's my honestly that's my best kept secret right there. Is uh stay away from your stuff. Yeah, he's swimming. He's swimming to the right. I'm thinking it's another pomp. They munching again today. We haven't been here very long. I love it. They're gonna swim all the way in. Look at this dude. He's another guy about right at 12 again. These aren't the same slabs we were catching out here with Tony the other day, but they are. They're all fat, nice and fat. I've caught two fish now out further, probably like 20, 30 yards past the breaking waves. And all my other rods have just kind of been hanging out. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna move this one out further. Two pop in one spot. To me, that means let's move another one in that zone. Oh, Dave got him a drag puller. That's definitely a drum. Feel head shakes? Yeah. Nice. Hopefully a nice big slot. Look at yours. <laughs> oh yeah. Cheyenne's got on something, hopefully. I hope he's not crossed. Yeah, it's, I'm wondering if it's crossed. Yeah. He's angry. Oh, dude. I think Dave, he got another rod over here going off. It's a big one. He's in like a school of drum or something.
Oh, this dude, he's he's strong. He's big. Yeah, you just keep on running. Oh, yeah, Cheyenne got her a nice red. I think a big school of red came through here and just grabbed grabbed all three of these rods. Yeah, we're not on the same fish, dude. This is a this is a bull right here. He's just heavy. He's holding ground. I don't think I've gained on him at all. Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh no! I think he popped off. Oh, that's a beautiful red. 30 incher. Nice. Cheyenne tearing it up. It's got the blue tail and everything. Oh, it's beautiful. 30 inches. Dave's still wearing his fish out. He's got him a bull. I'm guessing 35 plus, maybe even 40 inches. Have you even seen it yet? Let the waves pull him in. You want me to grab my fish grips? Yeah, I got you. Oh, he's, he's, he's big. Holy cow. Yeah, he's got him a bull. I think it's a big ugly. Oh yeah, he's got him a big ugly. Look at Dave with this sweet fish. Big ugly. He came out here he wearing them out. What was that? Five, ten minutes? Yeah. Sweet. We got to get a measure on that guy. He's a beast. Nice. It's like 36. <laughs> That's a sweet fish, man. <laughs> Dave's on him today. That's what, Pompano 5 for you? Four, four. Oh, dude, that's a slab. <laughs> that is a nice fish. Dude, that's like 14, 15 to the fork. Look at that slab. What we got, man? We got uh, 14 and a half. 14 and a half. Yeah, that's a, that's a sweet fish, dude. I, need to get out of there. I got a rod over here going off. David just caught a big old pop. So I'm on the other side of the beach, of course. Oh yeah, he running in. He's there. I know he is. There he is. He's just running straight in. And that's what they do. Man, I love catching pompano. They were some of the most fun fish to catch. And the extra benefit is they're delicious. There we go. There's that pump. I'm not getting the slabs Dave is getting, but man, it's still nice to get some dinner. Hey Dave, save some pump for us, man. <laughs> Dave is tearing them up. Every one of them is a slab too. I catch all the 12 inches. He gets the 13 to 16. How big was that last one? Uh, 14. Nice, man. Yep. You're getting all the studs. That's number six, isn't it? That's number six. That's a limit, man. Nice. What's that number six? Number six. I'm always way down the beach. I think you got something. Yeah, that's probably something. Yep, yeah, he's there. Probably another little pompano. Oh yeah, dude. We're tearing him up today. This guy, he's going for a run sideways.
There he is, I see him. He's 12 inch, we're gonna throw him in the cooler. He'll make a good little sandwich. Cheyenne on something good. Dave just hooked up on something that spit the hook. Likely a drum. And now Cheyenne's wearing him out. Oh yeah, I see him. There he comes. Oh, another beautiful red. Awesome job. There he goes. I didn't see the hit. Buddy David let me know something smacked it. Oh yeah, hopefully it's pump. It's running in. There he is. There's definitely a fish on there. Oh yeah, good head shakes. We had a little bit of a, a lull there. Not too many bites for a while. Cheyenne caught a nice red, but it's been slow. But hopefully he's picking back up. Oh yeah, he's feisty. If this is a pump, it'll be the limit. I'm gonna stock my freezer back up. I got my mom coming in town soon. She's gonna go home with some fish. She loves pompano. I mean, who doesn't? I've, I hear a few people who don't like pompano. Oh, there's two on there. I doubled up. Oh, that's sweet. Let's see if I can land both of them. Double pump! And that's why you use a double drop rig right there. When the pompano come cruising through, you get two nice fish like that. That's hard to beat a double up. There's number six. He was, a, he was one of the fish on that double up and that got my limit. We all had a great day out here. Man, Dave, Dave was tearing it up today. He caught a limit of pompano in no time couple big uglies one point we were all on a fish dave dave doubled up on two big ones cheyenne had that red that was that was just awesome so all three of us reeling in a big fish sadly i lost mine they both they both landed theirs but you know that's just how it goes sometimes you can't catch them all so he's pumped up i'm sure him going back home after that epic day is gonna make him want to come back just that much more but you'll be i know dave you'll be up there tearing up the the bass and your kayak i'm looking forward to seeing those pictures Cheyenne ended up catching four reds. They were all 29 to 32. Sadly, she couldn't take any of them home, but still awesome to catch a bunch of reds like that. All I caught was Pompano. They got all the all the big fish today. They, they must have been cruising. I'm just gonna tell myself that they were cruising on that side of the beach coming towards me and they just found all their baits first, but whatever, it doesn't bother me. I'm happy just to catch Pompano, but we all had a blast. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, comment. And until next time, take care and tight lines.